Well, I'm attempting to catch carp on my pack bait. You can tell I can't keep the little catfish off of it for very long. Jeez, another little catfish. As soon as I casted that out there, I can't even keep this bait on. Looks like it kind of foul hooked him a little bit. Yeah, the mouth and the dorsal one. Two. Little guy. Yet another little catfish. Ah, oh, man, these guys won't quit. I'm never gonna get a carp this way. All right, hooks out. my second spot of the day it's uh still cool low 70s overcast sprinkling showers um i picked this spot because i do know there is a lot of big carp in victory lake but just around the point my biggest clue that this might be a good spot was there's an old man that fishes out at this lake all the time he's out here every day and he's carp fishing and he is just around the bend of this point behind me and he's set up there so I know if he's fishing there, there's got to be a good reason. So I'm set up just on the other side of the point from him. He's just around the bend over there. So I'm, I'm just going off of what I see him do, and I'm thinking there might be some fish off this point. So we'll see what happens here in a few minutes. I got out, hard pack bait on. As you can see, the 888 Pro Staff with the Rhino Rod, and the 888 Pro Staff on whatever kind of heavy action yellow rod this is. All right, I'm gonna shut the camera off until I catch some. Stay tuned. Fish on here on the 888 Zebco Pro Staff on my pack bait. On the pack bait, right before I was going to leave, too. I was just getting ready to leave. All right, get the net situated here. Here, lost some slack. First carp out of Victory Lake. Ah, it's a chunk, too. All right, I'm going to run up to the truck and get my measurement. Oh, man. Should have packed up my tackle box yet. Run to the truck. Get the tackle box. Tackle box. Tackle box. All right. 
there he is. He's not super big, but he's a good one for my first fish on the pack bank out of this lake. Let's just get a measurement here real quick. Not super big. 17 inches. Probably one of my smallest carps of the season. Come here, guy. Got you at the bottom of the lip. There, he's off. Whew, what a powerful fish. There he is. Carp, look at the big old nostrils on him. That looks a little different than the usual species of carp. I don't know what kind. This may be a different species than common. But let's get him back in the water. And there he goes. Off he goes. Sweet. Just about ready to leave when that happened too. Didn't even think I had him. Seen my rod kind of jerk a little bit. Picked it up. Line went tight in my hands. Set the hook. Felt like he came off for a second. But he was still there. Wasn't as big a carp as I was hoping. I've been seeing a lot bigger ones jump around here, so I don't know. Maybe I have to come back out when I feel good again another day. Give this spot a try. It's pretty good though. For the first time in this spot. Alright. Get time to pack up and go home. Thanks for tuning in guys. Glad I finally got to catch a carp today instead of tiny little catfish all day. I'm out.